what an episode last one was, but aren't they all just great episodes? The first half, local labor and Utena just like fiercely just going like this, cranking it while just watching them just make out. Listen, you couldn't hear their moans, but I guarantee you in the Blu-ray DVD, the moans will be there. And it's kind of genius how they're able to market and have an incentive for people to like buy their product after they finish airing, right? Because everyone wants to see. Like, like even like um, Le Lebel's, you know, the coochie, it wasn't animated, so, you know, it's, it's gonna be there on the DVD. Now, uh, Kiwi showing that she had actually had three stars in her new form, that is fucking sick. And at the end, I believe we reached at the Lord's Domain, right? Time for a sick fight. Let's begin today's reaction. Ooh. She mad. Yokoso. Ho. Remember what I said? Remember, remember what I said? Like, you're like, hey, let's have some like random Japanese phrases that we know from anime. And someone said, ho. And I'm like, that's not Japanese, bro. But, but. Ho. <laughs> ho. <laughs> that's, that's why it is Japanese. <laughs> oh, and ho. You know, Lord and us, we have a similar weapon to whip, huh? Oh, here we go. Okay. Leopard versus... <laughs> Let's go! Leopard mode! <laughs> Just fucking die bomb. This is why Kiwi might be the best character. <laughs> you see those things? Just go... <laughs> Goodbye, sister! Nah, she's up, she's up. Why was she hiding it, though? I think we know why she was hiding it. Is there some kind of, like, consequence? Some penalty? Yeah, what the fuck was that? You can only use it for so long. Here's the penalty. The way you talk sounds like you feel bad for us. Whose side are you on? Oh, I feel so sorry for you because you're gonna about to die, bitch. I don't know. She did have a death flag, though. Oh, please, no death flag. <laughs> Fuck the power of friendship. We got the power of a love hotel. Now, still a death flag or not? I don't know. I <laughs> Actually delusional. Just fucking die! Okay, back in Utena fight. Oh, that's what we used on Kiwi in episode 3 or something. Yo, we both have like very similar powers, huh? Both are just like slap something and turns into a monster. <laughs> Utena, blood armor! Oops, penalty. Oof. That is brutal, dude. Power of hotel, come on. What should the thumbnail be? Uh, I don't think I should I put my toes there? No, nah, no. Nah. <laughs> Now focus, little part's in trouble. Oh? Oh. So maybe the attack that we missed wasn't missed, but we tried to hit a hole so she'd fall down? Okay, it's just a matter of the ground is breaking because she's so fucking heavy. Okay, she was intense for doing it. Good. She's stepping on her titty, bro. Did you hear that? When she stepped on a titty? Just fucking die. Was she faking or not? I don't know. Show me some real tears. Cry, bitch! Damn, Kiwi. Were you always just so cool? Whatever we say. Real tears, bitch! Come on, cry! Real tears! That's not fair! Oh. Intimidation. That was a bluff, dude! That was a fucking bluff! Yo... Sussy, 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 foaming at the mouth, you know, mind break, sussy. 
Damn. Hotel. No death flag. She survives? <laughs> yeah, she definitely wins. If she's gonna end the fucking battle slate, I'm so horny. Yeah, she's gonna live. Okay, back to the main fight. Utena? Lord? Huh? It's gonna break. Right, because like she's so strong, the only way to balance her is that it's like she always just gets towers really quick, right? Wake her up, suck and slap her. <laughs> Snap time! They're back! Finally! Yeah? I'm not gonna lie, I don't really have much confidence in them, but it's better than nothing. They've been training in the mountain for like five episodes. We did get very lucky there, huh? The transformation wore off immediately. New power, Sayu? What, what is that? Like, is she gonna do something heroic or is she just immediately gonna get, you know, gooped up and then she's gonna start being an M again? Sayu, I'm giving you a chance. You better not fucking fold immediately. They got, they got new form? La Verita! It just turned into ice dust. Koi, Hyorin Maru. What, what is this shit? <laughs> Yo, Sayo, new form! The training in the mountains actually paid off! I wonder if the other girls can do it. Well, can, can we do it too? They are magical girls. We're not magical girls. We don't have the magic item. But we do say trans magia, magia at the same time to transform. Tenna? You got a Bankai, Utena? You got something for us too? Wait, wait, I, but she has been training, right? Hold on, wait. No, it's the fact that you keep killing off all the magical girls that, you know, Utena gushes over. We can't gush over the magical girls if you kill them all. Also good point. Leopard didn't say it was La Verita. But Le I, I Leopard did have a second form, right? Because her base form is the gun with the jacket with the hat. But then she does turn into like the cat girl mode. So is that her second phase transformation? Just like Sayo's? <laughs> Anytime a villain makes this speech saying the strong will take from the weak, we immediately flip it on them and say, yeah, the strong does, you know, take from the weak. <laughs> She's doing way too much monologuing, just tripping death flags. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Yo, she didn't give a single fuck about that monologue. <laughs> Why is she posing? <laughs> Yo, the Lord probably seems very tuny to Utena right now, huh? What the fuck are you posing for? Bankai. You got a second form or what? Come on, show me. Good question. Why does she care about world domination? Huh? The magical girls do. And we gotta protect the magical girls to gush over them. There's the eyes again! Oh! Eight, 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 eight? Is that eight? Minimum eight, right? Because like you got one at the top left corner in the right corner. Then there's three here. And maybe who knows? Maybe she's fucking hiding one in the forehead too. Who really knows? But right now what's visible seems to be eight. New form? Oh shit, dude. Look at this new form. what I say? What did I fucking say like five minutes ago, huh? Anytime a villain starts monologuing, you know, saying like the fucking food chain bullshit, the strong taste from the weak, what happens right after? <laughs> There's more stars! What? One, two, three. Does, so, 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 does it keep growing? Does, does her stars just keep growing more and more? <laughs> She's a kid now. This is dangerous. So, Utena is able to turn enemies into lollies and bully them? 
Oh, what kind of punishment? <laughs> spank! We were the spank, right? Innocent spanking. <laughs> Your fingers too. They're all like purple at the end, huh? And her hair is way longer. Damn. Hey, chill! Chill! Oh, loco. Yeah, we already won. Don't worry about it. Cover your eyes. Don't worry about it. You took her age away. You took her, like, body away. What happened? What are we looking at? What, what, what? Who the hell is that? Utena. And Lord, but they can't tell, right? That's Lord Enormous. She's seeing her through her own filter. Who's seeing her through her own filter? Utena or Lord is? Lord is seeing her through her own filter, which looks like a kid. Because she sounded like a kid. Like a little kid, like a chuny kid talking about world domination. But then Utena can twist the Lord's image into something she'd be more into fighting. That's her new power? Only Utena can see the kid's version. Let me go back. Right? So from Loco's perspective there, right? So from our perspective, right? It was a kid. But from Loco and Label's perspective, how, do they look? how does she look like? Back to the adult form. So it was never about the... So she was never a kid. It, so only Utena sees her as a kid. Which just hypes her up even more. It didn't, like nothing about Lord got nerfed. It says Utena just got more hyped up because she made her into a little kid. <laughs> Kiwi's still alive, let's go! <laughs> Three stars. Even though it should have been four stars. Did we steal a star? <laughs> Get the Lord's ass! She got them BBLs. Oh my goodness! Ooh. It's, it's not a kid. It's not. A, it's stop! It's not a kid though. It's not. It's, it's a grown adult. What the fuck? Grown adult ass. Grown adult ass. Grown adult. Grown adult. No, not Lolly. Taking her powers away, we can just like remove stars. And there was the one instance where Utena's face, there was like multiple stars, not just the eight that we presumably see, but there was like multiple stars when she was able to filter, you know, Lord. Now we're gonna enjoy this. No, we should join in and spank her. You see that? 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 The star is like half gone here. See that? Hmm. <laughs> yes. Smack that ass. Yeah. Yo, at <laughs> Cody, so get in there. This is probably traumatizing for Labor and uh, Loco to see her, their like lord, be whipped like this. Dude, dude, look at this smug ass fucking face. Ooh. Don't rub it. What the fuck? Look at those eyes, dude. Did we take all the stars? Where is the stars going? It's just getting spanked away. Damn. Utena has evolved, bro. Utena straight up has just fucking evolved into some, like, I don't even know. She's the true dominatrix, huh? Oh, that's thumbnail for sure. What the fuck, Kiwi? What are you fucking... This is a band, you know? Look at Cody Sue. Hotel! 
Oh, wholesome ending. Wholesome ending. Lord? She's got one star left. Pride comes for the fall. What is Venna tell her to do? Borrowed or not? Borrowed power. Every girl here has borrowed power, right? Their powers come from within. The oh! I thought Venna was saying how, you know, these girls, you know, joined the gang and, you know, they got their powers, but it comes from within. But Lord was borrowing? Venna can just give the power. Is that why the stars were disappearing? Was that Venna taking the stars away? What was that? Was that really Utena taking the stars away? Or was that Venna? Because the power is correlated with stars. Apparently, Venna gave them the stars. So then Venna... Sorry, gave Venna gave them the power. So maybe Venna was the one taken away? I don't know. Every time she was eating Spank, the stars are kind of fading away. But now with this dialogue, maybe it was Venna. Throw away Venna's plan was to train up our group? Lord, was this the fucking training session? What the fuck? Gigantes could be joining us, right? Part of your plan to make them stronger. For what though? I still want to believe that... Well, well we've already replaced Lord now. Where are we going with this? Because I thought like Lord would like like live for like long i thought she was like an end game villain at the end it was like lord was power tripping and we need utena to get raised up so that you know lord stops killing the magical girls so that we have a healthy balance of magical girls and evil girls so they can gush over each other and that's like the the harmony that balance that i thought we were looking for but now it's different now it's like she just wanted to use lord as a training session for the rest of the girls they got stronger for exactly what I don't know, just to kill the magical girl? But that's what that's not what Utena wants. <laughs> what do you mean? I guess that's that. <laughs> what do you mean? What do you mean? What do you mean finished off? Venna, you can just do that? No one's questioning? What was that? Where did Gigante go? Gigante just disappeared. Gigante is hiding within... Venna? Sister shrink? Maybe sister just shrunk herself? Yeah? Love hotel. Love hotel. So that you guys can enjoy the hotel by yourself. You guys can have a room by yourself. Hotel. 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 See, in Chain Soldier, how many fucking seasons is it going to take for Kyoka to become Supreme Commander? But hey, in this Hachi show, she's already fucking Supreme Commander. Uh, eh? <laughs> and that's the episode. Damn, yo, there was a lot of plot, man. There was a lot of plot. Like, so far, I think the only plot that was kind of sprinkled in was, like, the power level with the stars about how Leopold was starless. But at the end of the day, she was hiding it. The stars correlate with power. And Venice said that the other girls, their powers come from within, as in these stars are genuine. But sometimes you can give powers. So Lord was always a one star, but then Venna gave Lord three extra stars. This is what I'm kind of interpreting. So my endgame plan that I told you about, about, about how Venna wanted to replace Lord with Utena so that the balance, the harmony of the magical girls and the evil girls was maintained, doesn't really seem to make sense anymore because we've already done that, right? What is Venna's true endgame plot? I don't know, maybe Venna is just like the final endgame villain and she just wants the evil girls to get stronger to kill the magical girls. But no, what did, what, what did Lord do? That doesn't make Cause like then I was gonna say, then Utena's gonna be like, no Venna, that's not what we want and fight Venna. But it's like, what is it that Venna told Lord to do and Lord refused, right? Lord betrayed Venna at some point. I don't know what that was. Was it? simply just like you know not accepting the other girls 
just like being hostile. I don't know, but the plot is fucking cooking. Now, I think we have two more episodes left. I'm sure next episode's gonna be a wrap up, and then we got the season finale, and I will be there. But hey, if you're still here, if you didn't enjoy this reaction, please like this video. Check out the other playlist for more content. And until next time, take care.